Prince William greeting the crowds in Ottawa last summer. By all accounts, it's a good time for William, happily employed as a search and rescue pilot, happily married too, and now he's $15 million richer. Today he turned 30 and so he inherits his share of his mother's estate. Anne McMillan now on the boy born to be king. He's lived a charmed existence. Beloved first son, heir to the throne, world traveler, teenage heartthrob, military career, fairy tale marriage. But being a prince has not always come easy. Where are we going? From an early age, Prince William knew he was no ordinary kid. His parents tried to protect him and his brother Harry from insatiable media interest, even after their acrimonious divorce. My first priority will continue to be our children. As a teenager, William made it clear he did not like being the center of attention. Known as the reluctant royal, he had to be encouraged by his grandfather, Prince Philip, to walk behind his mother, Diana's coffin. And that's why I find it very difficult myself to start with, because I'm a very private person. He gave rare interviews in exchange for being left alone. Oh. Over the years, there's been a transformation. Light Lieutenant William Wales loves his job as an air-sea rescue helicopter pilot. His happy marriage has boosted the monarchy's popularity. But as history shows, there could be pitfalls ahead. Royal watcher Andrew Pierce has this advice. Don't make the mistakes of Prince Charles, your father, who has embraced some very wacky, unconventional, unpopular causes. And don't be unfaithful to your wife. In fact, follow the example of your grandmother, the Queen, who's had a great marriage, never put a foot wrong in public. No chance of putting a foot wrong today. Palace officials say William's spending his birthday in a low-key, private fashion. His future is carefully mapped out. With each passing year, he'll be expected to take on more and more royal duties. There'll still be time for him to start a family here at Kensington Palace and to continue his work as a helicopter pilot. But it's all about duty and the fact that one day, William will be a king. Anne McMillan, CBC News, London.